This message is brought to you by the friends and partners of Kakra Baden. Welcome to Air Power with Kakra Baden, teaching the nations with signs and wonders. Kakra is the senior pastor of the Catch the Anointing Center, Accra, Ghana. Now, today's message. Welcome to today's broadcast. Kakra has been sharing an exciting message titled, Labor to be Blessed. Today, he delves into how the choices of God attracts his favor. Let's join in. Number two, God's choices. In John 15, 16, Jesus said, You have not chosen me. I have chosen you and ordained you that you should go and bring forth fruit and that your fruit should remain. Jesus said, When you allow me to choose anything, it will be fruitful. I will make sure that the thing succeeds. He said, it not only, I will not only make it succeed, he said, I will also protect it. He said, your fruit will remain. Whether therefore you eat or drink, or whatsoever you do, do all to the glory of God. Even basic things like eating and drinking. So as we allow God to make choices, even in small, small, small things, the Bible says the favor of God begins to grow. Because you can go for all night every Friday and be the most disobedient person. To me, it's a waste of time. But after we have done it and gone for all night every Friday, then I agree. God's choices. And Jesus said, I will protect it. One day, there was a certain gentleman who was working somewhere. And his boss was threatening to sack him. The man was so sad, always under pressure. Then one day, his boss's boss came and sacked his boss and promoted him. If God gives you a job, even if there are enemies in the job, he will prepare a table before you in the presence of your enemies. They will speak against you. They will malign you. They will try tricks. They can even take you out of the place. But the next thing that is coming is even bigger than where you were. That was Joseph. Even in prison, he was made a prefect. <laughs> Everywhere you go. And the Lord gave him mercy in the sight of the keeper of the prison. Genesis 39, 21. He showed him mercy. Potiphar's house. Before he realized he was there. Because his brothers, they hated him. They sold him into slavery. But the favor of God was too strong. Because his father made a quote for him. Simple quote. They were so jealous, they sold him into slavery. But before he realized he's in Potiphar's house and now even that clothes, now he has about 30 of them. And it was father, he had only one, but now he has about 30. Because the favor of God makes sure that even if he loses it, it will come back. Acts 7 9. The patriarchs moved with envy, so Joseph into slavery. But the Lord delivered him out of all his afflictions and gave him favor and wisdom in the sight of Pharaoh, the king of Egypt. The favor protected him. A man, a man, a man once told me a story. God had given him a vision that he was supposed to go abroad. And he didn't have any money. He told me he and his friend, it was one day for his visa to expire. They were standing at the first station and they saw the presidential motorcade of their country's president. And his friend said to him, why don't we go and follow the motorcade and go and ask the president for money? They followed the motorcade straight to the presidential palace. It's just surprising when they read the palace, when the gates opened, they didn't stop them, they drove in. And they sat amongst the people. Then after the president said, it's at that time the president was now going somewhere. So I think he was traveling. So as he said, they asked the president, President, we need money. 
He said, President, I don't have any money for you. Then he went into his car. He opened the door. He sat in the car. Motorcade was about to drive off. Then he said, the car stopped. The president opened the door and came out again. He said, the two of you follow me. He said, they go to a place. He said, wait here. He said, they were bodyguards. He said, later on, the president opened the door. He said, come in. He said, when they came in, they saw money. Then the president said to them, help yourself. <laughs> help yourself. He said that day, they bought the plane ticket, they did everything, and said so he flew out with a lot of money still in his pocket. He told me, God is good. When you follow God's choices, God will bless you. Thanks for joining us today. Remember to find favor with God. We must follow his choices in every area of our lives. Join us again tomorrow as this message continues. Before we go, here's a praise report to boost your faith. I am healed. Dear Kakra, I wrote to you to pray for me to be healed of a severe pain which I experienced at the right side of my abdomen and you replied that you had. To the glory of God, I am healed. Thank you for praying. May God be praised. Thanks for your time. You can contact us, seek counseling, ask for prayer, order today's full-length message or order books through the following means. Call us or message us on WhatsApp to plus 233 55 70 Send an email to info at .org. You can also make a regular call or send a text to plus 233 Our office hours are 10 a.m. to 1600 hours GMT. Finally, write to us, share your testimony and how this broadcast has been a blessing to you. Have you ever experienced periods in your life when you felt tired and disillusioned about the very things that used to excite you? It could be a marriage, a job, or your relationship with God. The daily grind of life can sap energy from your soul, mind, and emotions, leaving you depleted. Anything that expends energy needs to be recharged. Recharge your life with this exciting book by Kakrabaden, Energy Drink. It will keep you fired up to face each day with faith, hope, and love. You can order this book through the following means. Place your order on Facebook by posting Order Energy Drink in the comment section or message window. This book is also available as an ebook on Amazon Kindle or Kobo.com. We also deliver worldwide.